Now, your local weather with the KX News Storm Team. Hey, welcome back, everybody. Wanted to start out with the air quality index here on this uh, July evening. And uh, there's not a lot of spots reporting, but you can see the ones that are are all in this yellow color, meeting a moderate uh, air quality. Now, it's actually a little worse just to our southwest, places like southeast Montana. There, it's unhealthy for sensitive groups. But we're going to watch this and see if that air quality continues to deteriorate. The good thing is the smoke and that haze, it's uh, elevated way up in the atmosphere. So it looks hazy, the sky, but we're not really getting the effects of it here at the surface. Okay. You can see a very hazy day, nowhere, uh, really, no matter where you look. 96 in Williston, it's 104 down in Bowman. That's where we're seeing the real intense heat. Further east, 86 in Rugby, and I'll tell you what, Bismarck, 89. Certainly nowhere near, and we'll admit it, nowhere near what we were expecting the temperatures to reach today. Here are those temperatures. It's 106 right now in Hedinger. So, yes, very hot air is in a few locations in our viewing area, but they're down across our far southwest. Elsewhere, temperatures holding in the 80s and uh, low 90s. And in fact, Bismarck's one of the cooler spots there in the 80s. It's only 82 degrees. You go a little further east out towards Medina. So, yeah, it seems like Mother Nature is kind of trolling us a little bit. Where we're hyping up today saying it's going to be the hottest day of the year and mother Day, she's, no no we're not going to do that okay it happens sometimes two points it is very humid out there dew point of 70 degrees right now there in bismarck slightly drier air back off towards the west where dew points are in the 50s and 60s and with the uh, uh, humidity it, it bumps that feels like temperature up a little bit so 94 is what it actually feels like in bismarck feels like the 80s and 90s elsewhere across the board and the winds they're out of the south for anywhere from about 10 to 15 miles per hour so we do have that heat advisory across the southwestern half of the state it still does include williston uh, dickinson and bismarck there uh, but where the real heat right now, of course, is across the far southwest. So these passing clouds kind of keeping things, uh, those temperatures in check. We'll get a little more sunshine in between the haze here over the next few hours as these clouds pass by. You can see Minot already looking at a little bit of sunshine in the, uh, in the sky. Uh, let's go ahead and run precision cast because we do actually have a cold front that's going to be pushing through overnight into tomorrow morning. Some of our models are indicating that we could see a few thunderstorms develop across uh, maybe out towards Logan and McIntosh counties overnight. I don't think they're going to be a big deal, but if you are in, say, Ashley area there, uh, Napoleon area there, maybe a few raindrops overnight. Don't, again, I don't think it's going to be a big deal. But by tomorrow afternoon, we're going to get a strong northerly wind. So the winds will crank up. We'll keep these clouds around. Temperatures will be, again, warm, but not quite as warm as we have seen as of late. High pressure then begins to build in. That should clear our skies a little bit going on in towards Thursday. But there will be a few more chances for rain, especially across our western counties. A lows tonight, temperatures getting down only in the 60s and low 70s. That humidity will keep the heat in the air. Highs tomorrow, we are warming back in the upper 80s and 90s. Again, expecting Bismarck to uh, get quite hot. Might not, you'll be back up in the low 90s as well. Uh, let's look at Dickinson here. Your temperatures are actually going to be falling in a bit. We'll have a decent shot, at least a slight chance here of some thunderstorms on Thursday. Williston, your temperatures will be in the low 90s to the 80s on Thursday. So, yeah, a cooler day coming on Thursday, closer to seasonal averages. Check out that camera. Look how hazy it is out there everywhere you look. My not temperatures in the low 90s tomorrow will be quite windy with that northerly wind. And then temperatures in the upper 80s and low 90s as we go through the rest of the week. Bismarck, another hot one tomorrow. Um, I think that tomorrow is going to maybe end up hotter than what we were supposed to be mm. today. Go figure. The other thing, it's dry out there, yeah. guys. One day at a time. That's all we can do. Yeah. Next in our 5 at 5, Cal.